Hi friends, Radhika Ravi Kumar here. So in this tutorial, we'll see some of the process-related commands. So the process, in order to display the uh, processes that are running in your system, just say ps. You can see uh, the the PID, the terminal, the command your bash and the, the process ID processes are running in the backend. If you want to see all the processes, you know, all your system processes, then you just need to say ps hyphen f sorry uh, e that is e is nothing but extended. So, this will uh, list out all the processes of your system. So, in order to get the full information of your processes, just you need to say e f so, E is for extended, F is for full information. So, you will be getting all the information like um, you can see it here. The UID, the user ID, then your PID, parent ID, sorry, process ID, then the PPID, parent process ID, then C, maybe the CPU time, S time, the terminal time, then the command. So, you can make use of all this information for any um, other purposes. So, uh, as of now, uh, we will uh, see how we can uh, make use of these basic um, uh, process related commands like uh, for example, if I have a requirement like I need to list out only the oracle process, then how will I be doing it? For that, you just need to say ps minus e uh, ps hyphen e f. We know this will list out all the processes and uh, with the full information. Okay. So now I am going to give this output to another command that is my grep command. We know this grep is mainly used to search a string. So grep I will say oracle because we need um, only the oracle process. So it will just uh, this output will be in such a way that it will list out only the processes which is having this oracle string. So it is nothing but uh, the listing out the all the oracle processes. So you can see all the oracle processes are listed out. So this is how you can accomplish uh, the requirements by using your pipe commands as I have discussed in, it in previous tutorial. So, another uh, thing is like uh, uh, how to kill a process, we will see that. So, to kill a process you just need to say kill, this is the kill command, then you need to give your PID. For example, let me open up another terminal. So, let me use my PS minus E command. So, you can see there are two, this is the PID, then the terminal, PID and the terminal. So, there are two sessions open. So, what I am going to do is, I am going to say kill and then give the process ID that is um, 3431. Okay. So, nothing happened. Uh, sometimes your process will not get uh, killed. For that sake, you need to say kill hyphen 9 hyphen 9 means it forcibly will kill the uh, process. You can see the other terminal uh, got uh, ended that that means the process got ended. So, basically in order to kill a process just say kill and give the um, PID. So, in case if it does not get killed the normally if the process do does not get um, you know ended normally then just say kill hyphen 9 which is a forcible way of killing and for sure this will work kill hyphen 9 and the process id so hope uh, you have understood uh, this and in case if you want more information regarding your process related command then just say uh, use your manual command like man ps so you will be getting all the information regarding your process command here you can make use of this and learn more so hope you have uh, enjoyed my tutorial and uh, thank you very much for watching